You've probably been thinking that it's okay and convenient to have Google remember your password. Well, imagine finding out that those passwords were left unprotected for 14 years! Hi everyone, I'm Frederick, and welcome back to another episode of Cinedis Cybersecurity News. Some big news was revealed just a few days ago. Google admitted that it had mistakenly been saving G Suite user passwords in plain text, again for the past 14 years. 14! So apparently that was due to a bug, yeah, thank god it wasn't voluntary, right? And it means that users' very personal information was in open air for a very long time. I'll quote David Kennedy from Trusted Set, which is an IT security consulting firm. Quote, the fact that this was around since 2005 and wasn't caught is disconcerting. End of quote. Well, frankly, that's to say the least. To me, it's mind-boggling. Anyway, a little background on what G Suite is. It's a product by Google that offers a platform with a wide range of online software and services, like Gmail, YouTube, Google Drive, and so on. Apparently, the bug originated from a tool designed for B2B accounts, known as the Admin Console. That bug led passwords to be saved in plain text, instead of being encrypted with a hash to ensure more security, and which is like a basic industry standard of security that any like little website is already knows that have, that's the way you have to do things. Come on, Google. Google claims that only a few companies had been affected in 14 years. So the tech giant announced that the appropriate security measures have been taken and apologized, stating how, quote, it did not live up to its own standards, end of quote. Well, you're damn right it didn't, like far from it. Unfortunately, this is not an isolated case and Google is far from being the only one to have failed to protect users' data. Twitter and Facebook have also mistakenly saved unprotected passwords as plain text in the past and have recognized that it affected many of their users. These examples serve as a strong reminder that even companies as big and known as Google, Facebook and Twitter with an army of techies just dedicated to cybersecurity, do face issues with data breaching, and unfortunately, on a fairly recurring basis. So I would advise my viewers to be more restrictive with the type and amount of information they share or store on any online platform, whether social media, cloud storage, and so on, to use two-factor authentication when available, to protect their passwords, and, whenever possible, to encrypt the data before putting it online. Remember, be safe online and offline. We'll see you soon.